At five, as we approach the rainy season, these fish may save our skin. Quite literally, more than 23,000 of these fish are taking mosquitoes down in Collier County right now, and they're being handed out to people as part of this program. Wink News reporter Michelle Alvarez joins us live at Connor Park in North Naples, right off of Vanderbilt Drive. Lots of water around there, Michelle. Tell us more about these fish and how they help. Yeah, Chris, mosquito fish only grow to about one and a half inches long, but they eat almost everything, including insects, snails, algae, and of course, mosquitoes, which can carry dengue fever and chikungunya. Everyone knows how annoying mosquitoes are, which is why as we approach rainy season, we're following up on Collier's Mosquito Fish Program. We wanted mosquito fish to be available to our residents as another means to controlling mosquitoes and standing bodies of water, small bodies of water within their yard or residence, like ditches, animal troughs, um, flooded yards in the wet season. Since the program started in 2018, they've given out over 23,000 fish. Research states that one mosquito fish adult can eat up to 100 mosquito larvae a day. So they are appropriately named the mosquito fish. And so they can exhaust a mosquito larval um, population and a stagnant body of water pretty quickly. Rachel Bales is a biologist with the Collier Mosquito Control District. She failed to send on how the breeding process works. So we have a two tank system. We have the breeding tank and then the grow out tank. We have breeding baskets for the fish. So the um, babies will come up through the top. We'll collect them and put them in a section on this grow out tank until they're mature enough to go back into the breeding system and repeat the cycle. And if you're wondering how to get involved with the program, they can go on the website and request the fish and then book an appointment with us. We have fish available on Thursdays. For the first time ever, the district will be able to go out into the community. They recently got this van with a mosquito fish tank inside, giving them the opportunity to bring mosquito fish anywhere in the county. We get a lot of positive feedback on social media and people coming in each year getting fish again. The Collier Mosquito Control District will have their first mosquito fish distribution event at North Collier Regional Park on June 1st from 10 a.m. to noon. For more information, just head over to WinkNews.com. I'm live in Collier County, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News. All right, thank you, Michelle.